Hey everyone, welcome to my channel. Thank you so much for watching this video and for spending some minutes with me. Today I want to give you an update uh, around solar energy and my investments. I do it through this platform called Energia and I have other videos in my channel about these investments. Um, as you can see, I started investing in solar energy in July 2023 and today it's uh, the 1st of January 2024. And so I have about seven months or five months of history with uh, this platform. Uh, so far, I have invested $1,500 and I've also reinvested the, the dividends that they have paid me. So these $15.02 are reinvested in the platform itself. I like, it, I like the fact that you can click here and see the evolution of the cost per share. So I invested, for example, $150 in Brazil in back in July and also in South Africa at 87 cents per share or $1.19 per share. And today the, the same investment would be done at, has been done at 89 cents a share or $1.23 a share. And so the market value of these uh, investments, $1,535.27. And this uh, investment is generating a 12% return to me. So uh, if we click here, there is no breakdown, but I can show you the breakdown in a different page right now. So if we scroll down a bit uh, more, uh, what we can see is that uh, both Brazil and South Africa uh, provide different returns. So while in South Africa, it's only 9.3%, uh, in Brazil is 14.4%. So one of the things I'm thinking is uh, uh, stopping the investment in South Africa and add adding additional investments only in Brazil because I'm interested in this higher return here. Uh, usually the return is uh, that is uh, the market value uh, that goes up and down and also the company pays some dividends. So that's also included in the return. And then you can see further down here there is some information regarding the expected additional investments that I'm making uh, over on, on a monthly basis. So I, you know, the next one is going to be in Feb, and then there is also some uh, dividends that will be paid out uh, at the end of January. So the other thing you can do is you can export some of this data. If you go into the return here, you can export you can export the data since July. Uh, I've done it here in this Excel file. This allows you to calculate where the numbers are coming from. So what, you know, what they give you like a detailed uh, activity. So I invested in both projects in July and I've been making some additional investments and you can also see when the dividends were reinvested. And then, you know, they give you all the information and then there is the calculation formula, which is this one here which is the formula, the standard formula for calculating IRR. And so this is how, where you can see that this project is giving me uh, that 12%, uh, or including both, both portfolios. And they also give you a couple of additional formulas. One is for cash on, cash on cash yield and analyzed cash on cash yield. So the dividends, uh, mean it, you know, they represent about 5% on an hour basis, but that included in this uh, you know, final 12%. The other thing I like about the platform is that in the website here, if you scroll down, they keep adding information about uh, what happens to the project on a monthly basis. So for example, as you can see here, that 14.4% uh, is divided into two categories, right? So the appreciation of the investment themselves, and we've seen that in the change of the share prices, and then the dividend yield, right? So this is where the 14.4 is coming from. And they also provide information on a monthly basis regarding the, the project. So if, for example, I open this one and we read here, it says this month's dividends were precisely in line with our projections. However, while the Iwatama site has shown excellent performance in recent months, it faced a significant setback in November due to an, an incident of theft. So on November 8th, copper cabling was stolen, leading to a complete shutdown of the site. We responded promptly by ordering replacement parts, yada, yada, yada. So I like the fact that they, you know, they give us all this information and you can understand what's going on, how, you know, the different issues they are facing. They've also made the video, so you can watch the video and see this, uh, you know, the, this particular location. 
And then the same type of description is provided on a, you know, for the other months as well. And then if we scroll further down, uh, this, you know, this section here with the map shows you the particular portfolio of assets. So I'm showing you this so in the future we can see uh, the evolution of this. So we have uh, all these projects that are already cash flowing. They have a couple of sites that are under development and uh, or initial development and four sites that are under construction at the moment. So, so far, everything seems positive. Uh, I'm very happy with the information they provide and how things are going. I'll probably keep investing in solar energy through this platform. Um, and But what I'll probably change is uh, you know, the investments that I'm making from February forward, instead of investing in both uh, Brazil and South Africa, most likely I'll just add funds into the Brazilian ones so I can get this higher return. So thank you so much for watching. I hope you find this interesting. If you like it, please like the video and subscribe to my channel. Until to you soon.